Might have taken two of the bloody coin mech was uh, active. Anyway, <clears throat> anyone fancy a bit of JPM bars and X's? A mixture of System 80 technology with a bit of MPS. As in MPS reels, MPS power supply, but System 80 in out, System 80 8K CPU, and some kind of hopper. How's that for a combination? Obviously, because of the short arse, I mean, sat on there. I put the lights in the bottom, I quite like that. You can put all the credits on you want. I've never seen the plus repeat chance happen. In fact, I've only seen the jackpot a few times. And the only way to play it is through the pull handle. That is the only way to play it. There's no... I suppose they could have had a, a green start button there, maybe. every time you get a win it lights up when they're paid oh yeah and if you hold anything you can't de-hold them so you have to make up your mind and I've three nudges now and then help you along the way it's quite funky isn't it Tell you what, it's bang on every time with the coins. I think what it does is some kind of sensor that counts them out. But 10 p a play and one only 150 jackpot is a bit of a rob dog really. I guess you'd say it was a probably a novelty game, I guess. I guess there was a few of these about in the day. I mean, this is just a short, uh, short ass version of what I was playing in Olympiad Arcade the other week. But this one, you do have to pull the handle properly. You can't get away with it. You can't get away with it. You have to all the way down. So it's probably a little bit better. Although I, I haven't actually looked at the, uh, the pull arm mechanism to see where the switch is. I'm sure it would, it would have to be a switch. I mean, you don't even pull the reels up a little bit, does it? So they just literally go down. Oh, I'll put a few credits on it. I do like this machine, to be honest. Kind of an easy platform. Bloody hell. No, it's not complicated, it's easy enough. Or cash. So yeah, it's micro controlled. It's nice that the, the reels light up, isn't it? I've got a whole day I watch they do light up. Only the middle. Although there is lights on all three here we go a nice little run and if you notice the winner paid lights up which is quite cool as well it's when the call attendant lights up you don't want although no don't normally do that it normally just sprays down <laughs> when it 
wants to. Like I say, I see this as some kind of, it's, it's a novelty machine, it's not as, but you can lose serious money on it though, if you don't get anything out of it, especially at 10p a go. after nudges. Oh, there we go. Hold. It's got nice colours. This hasn't been on since we've uh, been away and been back, so it's not been on for a little while. Yeah, it's always time for a little blast. And I know there's a few fans of this. If I had the money, I'd get this re-chromed. Because I think when, when Vinnie bought it, the chroming was quite bad on it, so he's just like silver painted it, but it looks so much better if it was re -chromed. But I guess that would cost like four or five hundred quid or more. All cash payout. No messing. No tokens. It's red art in there. And it's a front opener, <laughs> and it was made in eighty six. And that arm handle, <laughs> it's nice. Nice little touch. And of course, it's got the lovely System 80 sounds, the old early sounds as well. Although this is a very late System 80, extremely late. In fact, two years after they're finished. They've gone, they've gone back to the early deep sounds of like sevens up, that kind of machine. Like I say, although this is 1986, which is actually two years after the release of uh, MPS1. But there you go. Anyway, I'll have a couple more of those and then we'll... Never holds after an edge, always lights them in the face. There you go. What's not to love? It's a fruit machine. <laughs> What is not to love? And there you go. I just wanted to, I know there's a few videos of this and, and people do like it. But yeah, so JPM, I'm pretty convinced that it's a, re a rebuild, but I, I don't know, I don't know. It's got some label on the back that I can't make out. It doesn't look like it says bars and X's. But there you go. Like that, yeah, and a trap mode on a one arm bandit. How cool is it? <laughs> there you go. Absolutely lovely machine. So there you go. Bars and I've, I've got the window open. Well, the window open. So lucky lady. I have a room virtually full of System 80s at the moment. Apart from MPU2. MPU1, MPU1, space, everything else in here is system 80. 
and it's about to get crowded. And there you go, that's another story. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that, folks. A bit of bars and X's from uh, JPM. Really nice machine, tucks in anyway, it's nice and small, and a nice hopper payout, which is my only, it's my only hopper payout machine out of a hundred odd machines, the only one I've got. Anyway, I've bored you enough, I'll see you in a bit.